Am I the a-hole for asking my wife to spend all her savings? I'm a 34-year-old and married to the love of my life a 33-year-old f. My wife is kind, nurturing, and motivated in her career. She does a lot for me at home since I work long hours. We married for months ago, dated for 8 years, we're both easygoing and have the same sense of humor and rarely argue. I make for x more money I'm in healthcare, but she makes a good salary as well. Since I make for X what she does I tend to pay for most things, dinners, weekend trips, mall shopping which I absolutely do not mind. With bigger purchases we pay for things together in proportion to what we make. She's usually okay with paying her share of things one quarter of the rent and groceries and will sometimes offer to pay for dinners and dates. She's very close with her best friends she has four. They're great people but they're basically attached to the hip and talk daily in a group chat, which is fine. Everyone needs a support system. I have similar friends. Her and her for friends have a combined savings account together for investing in something together. They've each been putting in a few hundred dollars per month each. I've known about this for years and didn't love the idea initially, which I expressed. But she was adamant she wanted this end at the time. We weren't hurting for the money and it was ultimately her money and her decision. We are now looking to buy a home in one of the most expensive real estate markets in the US. She expresses that she doesn't have much in her own savings, but has 20,000 of her own money tied in with her friends' combined savings. Over the last year they've been told by two financial advisors that five people attempting to invest together in real estate or stocks or business wasn't a great idea. And they also recommended splitting the funds to five separate accounts, since the account is under one of the friend's names and there are tax implications for having that amount of money to her name 100k. The homes we're looking at need around 60 to 70k for a down payment. I stated I was willing to spend nearly all my savings for the down payment for a home 50,000. So I told her she should pull that money from her joint friend's account to help with the down payment. It's a huge purchase and I don't think it should be my burden alone. She got really upset and told me I don't want to touch that money. I promised my friends it would be for investing together. We should look for a less expensive home then, maybe a fixer-upper. She then stated It would be easier for you to accrue the money back since you make so much more. This was very frustrating and I told her It's unfair I have to spend nearly all my savings and you don't. Your friend fund is stupid and it's stupid not to use that money for our future home. Am I the a-hole for asking her to use her own cash from her friend's account? Breaking that promise to her friend so we can buy a nice home together. Here are the top comments. Not the a-hole. Married or not, I would not buy a house with someone who would rather have an uncertain investment fund with friends than help me with the down payment of our shared house and considers my savings our savings and her savings her savings. Never wipe out your savings for a down payment, especially when buying a house. I swear I had more unexpected house expense in the first year than I did in the next decade. Not the a-hole. No, but I would seriously reconsider buying a house or if you do make her sign a postnuptial. If you can pony up $50,000 and you have essentially been footing all the bills also she can save money with her friends. The sad part is that money is just sitting in an account and not being invested and your wife and her other two friends have zero claim to any of the money unless their names are on the account.